What is going on, guys? Welcome to Brad's Parlay of the Day. Today, I got a two late parlay for Wednesday, June 19th, 2024. Here at Pick Dogs, we drop the most repeat videos out of anyone, so click that subscribe button. Drop a like, it helps us out a lot. If you guys want the picks like the best, the picks like the most, the picks that I've made myself personally, go to pitdogs.com, click the premium pick section, or click the link in the description of this video. You'll find all my plays there. All righty, guys. Hope everyone's doing well. A little recap. While I'm recording this, our parlay hasn't gone off. It's the Panthers and the Liberty. Hopefully, that hits. The day before that, we had Celtics first quarter money line. That hit. But then we had Jason Tatum over nine and a half rebounds. I believe he ended up with eight. So, tough loss there. We need to bounce back. And hopefully, uh, hopefully Tuesday's parlay hits. And then hopefully Wednesday's parlay, which I'm about to give out, hits. If you're new to this channel, I give out two picks that I'm very confident about. Typically, they're money line picks. Um, and basically, if it's even odds or over, I give it out. It's not much of a lottery ticket parlay. So just look at it as a straight bet, one unit, single play, nice, simple, easy. So let's get this going, man. For the first leg, I'm headed to the WNBA where we got the Aces versus the Seattle Storm. It's been a tough year for the Las Vegas Aces. Um, it's kind of hard to get a, re a, a read on this team because, I mean, they're good as hell. They have one of the best players in, in the world uh, when it comes to females, as with Wilson. But for some reason, they just can't get it together. Um, they lost four of their last five. They're six and six. They haven't covered a spread since, like, I don't know, like 1984, it seems like. But I'm still going to take them today. I think this is a good spot for them. They're coming off that bu that brutal loss to New York um, at, at, on their home floor. It wasn't even that close. New York kind of took off at the end and, and kind of blew them out. They only won by eight. But, I mean, it was, the score was much worse um, if you actually watch that game in, in that fourth quarter. But I think they, they come to this one a little pissed off. And when it comes to the Storm, you know, they're coming off a, a really questionable loss to the Mercury, a nine-point loss in, in a game that they were three-and-a-half-point favorites. Before that, when we look at their wins here, uh, you know, they beat the Dallas Wings, they beat the LA Sparks, two, two kind of trash teams. And then they took a loss to a Minnesota Leafs team, and the, the Leafs are a really good team. So I, I kind of see the Storm team beating up on the bad teams being competitive with the uh, the better teams. And, you know, these teams actually played, let's see, it was on June 7th, and the Storm beat them. The Storm beat the Aces. I don't think they do it back-to-back, -back, man. Uh, there's a reason the Aces are a 6-16 to but are still six-point favorites in this game. So I think it's a good spot, bounce-back spot for the Aces. I'll take them on the money line. Next, let's let's get a little Euro pick, man. We got Croatia versus Albania. Um, this is probably the biggest mismatch of the day. I'm going to take Croatia on the money line. Look, Croatia is getting a little bit older with some of their core guys. But we've seen, man, no matter if it's the World Cup, the Euros, Croatia is always a scrappy team. They always seem to be in there at the end. And they're never a tough beat. Uh, when it comes to Albania, I mean, they're one of the lower pack teams in this whole damn tournament. They're plus 25,000 to win it all. And uh, that's the second worst odds in this whole tournament, whereas Croatia is plus 5,000. Let me see what the group odds are for this group. I assume that uh, Albania is pretty... Yeah, for this group, Group B, Albania is plus 10,000 to win the group, which is dead last in this group. So Albania is the worst team in this group. Um, Croatia is always scrappy. They're, they're the better team on paper. They should be able to get the job done. So, and I mean, damn, these, these, Euro, these Euro games have been a little sketchy with what help happened to Belgium. Um, I mean, that Portugal game today was hella close. It may be a little bit of sweat, but I think there's a reason that Croatia is uh, minus 200 in this one. So that's going to do it, guys. Uh, parlay the aces on the money line, Croatia on the money line. You should get about even odds there. You get a little bit of plus money. Um, but yeah, man, I appreciate all you watching. If you want to follow my handicap or more closely, you can follow me on Instagram at Brad Bets. I post all my wins and losses there, my pit toss content, other free picks. It all funnels back into there. But most importantly, subscribe to pit toss on YouTube because we're just trying to help you guys win some money. I'm going to catch you tomorrow.